It's always going to be a mark of shame that the Republicans in the Senate actually violated their oaths last year. They failed to fully consider and fairly consider the well-qualified uh, nominee for the vacancy on the Supreme Court. Now, we take oaths of office to advise and consent. Well, President Obama honored his oath of office. He sent the nominee, uh, to, uh, sent a nominee to the Senate who was well-qualified. Republican Senate refused to even uphold their oath. They wouldn't even consider Merrick Garland. Even the Republicans who colluded in this blockade would tell you privately they thought Merrick Garland would make a great Supreme Court justice. He'd be a consensus Supreme Court justice. Now, as a candidate, Donald Trump endorsed that ugly blockade. He actually urged the Senate Repub Republicans to delay, delay, delay. This is really a stolen Supreme Court seat. Now you have some of these ultra-right-wing organizations. They want to fill that stolen Supreme Court seat. Well, the federal judiciary is supposed to be independent. This is no way to treat them. The Senate, the Senate wants to redeem itself. It owes the American people a thorough and an unsparing examination of the candidate that President Trump proposes to fill a seat on the highest court in the land. And I would say the American people deserve a nominee of the same caliber and the same mainstream views as Judge Garland. They deserve nothing less.